Hey everybody, Lippy26 here, and I am playing Pikmin Mom, uh, but as you can see, I'm in a different house. <laughs> I'm playing single player to give you a tutorial, and the tutorial that I'm going to give you is how to make Pokeballs. The first thing you need to do is make a house. As you can see, I already have house, but I'm going to show you how to make an iron one, because I have the materials here. So, first of all, you need to get your wood and make so make some oak plants first of all, oak planks first of all, and then make some sticks. So yeah, four is enough. And if I look into my chest here, I should have some iron. I need five bits of iron. And then go back into the crafting table, put your sticks here, and then boom, you have an iron hammer. So now we have an iron hammer. You need anvil. You need anvil that looks like this, which is a pokeable one. Or oh, you can make aluminium plates on it as well. Um, and then, like this one, is the one that you use for enchanting. So you don't need that one. So this one, which you should get in your starter pack when you first join, and if you do slash get start. So next thing you need is apricorns. So you find apricorns applicants on plants like this and how you can get them I see some of them aren't grown so you just click the top and that's how you get them so yes they start like this but you can also break them if it doesn't let me I put the red bed in <laughs> you can break them and get wood but it's not gonna let me show you this and get wood. So yeah, so I've got some there. But I've got some that I got earlier, which I can find in here. And what I'm going to make is going to make a standard pokeball. So what you need for a standard pokeball is iron, apricorns, so red ones. And you need cobblestone. Oh, well, actually, you need stone. So, first thing I'm going to do is take some of the stone in there. I'm going to cook these red apricorns. I'm going to put most of them in there, so half of them. So it's quicker if you do it this way. And wait for them to cook. While I'm doing that, actually, I can go into here, put three iron ingots in a row, and you get five iron discs. This is the bottom of the pokeball. So as I have them, I will start this process while I'm waiting for them to cook. So you select them to go onto the anvil by right clicking, and then you grab your hammer and left click to turn it into an iron piece. That is the base of the pokeball. So if I just do it with these other ones as well, just to show you again. So you right click to put it on there, then you get your Pick, uh, you get your hammer and left click to do it. Different speeds for different types of hammer. So if I do it with the iron one, it will be a bit slower. But don't do what I just did and right click. So do that and left click. Okay, so go onto your iron disc, right click, go to your hammer, left click. And there we go. So I have five of those. So now if I go back into here, I've got my stone. Reading the stone is you need stone for the bottom. So I've got my apricorns. So now if I go into here, now that they're cooked apricorns, you need to make sure they're cooked because if they're not cooked, you won't be able to use them. And then put three in a row like this, then I'll get pokeball lids. Or discs. So I click them back up and then go over back to the anvil again, you do the same thing again. Oops, not like that. So, you right click to put it down, then use the hammer, you use left. Make sure you do that or you will do what I just did. So, let's just do with these. So, right click, left click. 
Right click. Left click. Right click. Left click. And there we go. We have the lid and we have the lid now. See, poking lid and base. So now all we need is to create the button in the middle. So how you do this? Put the stone in, and you get buttons. Easy as. So then you put the button in the middle, the lid at the top, iron base at the bottom, and boom, you have pokeballs. So now you have five pokeballs. Uh, there's different variants of pokeballs that you can get. I will show you a, another one. Um, show you the premier ball. So this is how you make the premier ball. You need, you need white paper balls. We're just waiting for a few of those to be dead. Let's get some more buttons. Or we'll get some stone even. That's if we got to look more red. Some white. There we go. Right. So we need to make some more iron bases. We have five. Different pokeballs won't like, give you different things as well. So there we go, so the premier this, so you only get three of these ones because they're more premium. So you do exactly the same thing again. As I said, it's a long process, depending on what type of hammer you have. This is why I'm using diamonds, just to speed the process up. So I need three bases. Get right click, left click, right click, left click, right click, left click. So we go, I have the bases. So if I now get a button, get the premium lid, and there we go, we have now have premium rules. So if I do one more, so we're going to use we're going to make. We're going to get some black and yellow. So if we put that in. And black, yellow, and white. I believe make so if you press G you can see all of them so uh, I to put balls in you can see how to make all of them and there you go there's all of them this is how you make them so you can put them in a line like that to make them but we're doing it this way. I believe it's just black and yellow for an ultra ball. So that's what we're going to do next is ultra ball. There we go, ultra ball. You only get one, this one, so I'm going to multi select it. And you can only select it by pressing shift and it just does the amount that you ask for. So yeah, because with their higher balls you get less of them when you do them. So right click, left click. So there we go, now we have two ultra balls. Well, we'll do. After we put them together like this. See, now I've done a silly thing and I ran out of buttons, so to make a button again, you stick the stone on there and get a button like that. Simple as that, you can't do it with cobblestone because if you do it with cobblestone it doesn't work. I've made that mistake many times. So there we go, ultra ball. We have ultra two ultra balls, three premier balls and five 
pigments. So that, my friends, is how you make it. So I hope this tutorial has helped you um, to make Pokeballs. And yeah, I will be making more tutorials and I hope you enjoy them. I'll see you later, guys. Bye. Ooh.